Back here at home, students taking the stage tonight after tragedy hit their high school this fall. People from really all over the region came out tonight to support Central Visual and Performing Arts High School. Nearly two months ago, a gunman killed a student and teacher there. Dion Broxton explains how tonight's event is helping the community move forward. Friday night was for the arts. And I love the theme, bringing the joy back, because that's what's going to help us move forward. The Center of Creative Arts in University City hosted a benefit show for the Central Visual and Performing Arts High School. The South City School lost a student and staff member after a shooting inside CVPA in October. I'm grateful for the alumni who had the desire um, and the willpower to put this together. Our Coca teaching artist is the one who organized this whole event. I would like us to do a moment of silence for our, um, our fallen loved ones. Through lots of emails and phone calls and texts and um, volunteers, we got a large show together. We have some survivors in the room. Let's give them a cheer of victory. Organizers for this event say money raised from items like these will go to help CVPA students. We will, would like you to spend it however you think it is going to su best support your staff and the students. I think this is a really wonderful, beautiful um, opportunity to showcase just how powerful the arts can be in terms of healing. The school is preparing for the next big step of students returning next year. They're still doing virtual learning. We are looking forward to having students in person in January um, when things are, are, are ready to go. In University City, Dion Broxton, News 4.